What's going on, YouTube? This is Flamesword here, and today... Wait, 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 wait. I know what you all have been asking me, what you all have been asking me for the entire past week is how come you guys have not been playing Halo. So we got two things for that. One, Ace has gotten extremely sick, which has kind of put a damper to our entire, you know, just practice schedule and whatnot. He's trying to get over that, so we're trying to make sure that he gets super, super well by uh, Michigan so that hopefully for championship season one finals at PAX e, he's going to be feeling to uh, the best of his ability, and that way he'll perform at the top of his... Condition. Also, the other reason that we have not been playing, I know a lot of you have been like, yo, I wanted to see the old status quo play. You enable assault and blah, 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 our boy Ace, who I was just talking about being sick. And I know you all wanted to watch him, but unfortunately, the past two cups have been tough. As we do know, enable himself, if you guys have been keeping up with him, has a move on to a new Call of Duty team. And Championships is right around the corner for them. So that is super important for them. And as we do know, Call of Duty has 2Ks and 5Ks, uh, 2Ks every Saturday and 5Ks every Sunday. So because of that, it was going to be super, super difficult to play with Enable the entire time. We would have to worry about basically making the other team wait a bunch. And then if they were down to wait, we would just have to wait until he's done with his match on Call of Duty. And then come over here. So then we could do that match. But then we're holding them up for his next match on Call of Duty. And you see how confusing I just sound right there. That's how confusing it would have been for us to play. So we decided not to play. And, uh, you know, good. Uh, thankfully, in my opinion, is that Ares' team now is right there fighting for the 7th. Or 8, 7, 6 seed. They got enough points. I believe they're chilling now in the 10th or 9th seed. So they're right behind the people to make sure that they do get qualified for the Season 1 Finals. And I'm happy about that. I didn't want to do this whole dropping and swapping uh, players with uh, APG for Ares' spot if he wasn't able to make it to the Season 1 Finals since he did just do a hard job playing in our team and successfully getting 3rd and 4th. So I, I thought, no doubt in my mind, he deserved to be at the Finals. So... I think it was a good thing that we couldn't play with Enable, even though all you wanted to watch us. But that allowed their team to come in, so we'll be able to compete against them at the finals. It's almost looking like, depending on how well they place at the next event in Michigan, which uh, I'm assuming they're going to place really well because they've been practicing a shit ton. And that now brings me back more to this video. Now that it is uh, past those two cups, it is the transfer period, February 1st to, I believe, February 7th or February 8th. So now we are allowed to officially add APG to our roster, and that's exactly what we're going to do, which means the next following two cups that are uh, coming out before the uh, February 21st, 22nd event, which is our next Halo event in Michigan at the University of Michigan, I believe it is Gamers for Giving, the two-day event. It's uh, who I shaved my beard for for the charity in order to uh, raise $9.3 thousand dollars to be able to build two cards, which will be uh, one of them will be at the uh, event. Uh, supposedly I am hearing with my emblem of me with my face and my beard so it's gonna be pretty cool so if you all definitely participate in that be sure to come out to the uh, University of Michigan I will put a link of the event in the description below so you all can click it if you're in the area and you're like oh yo I want to go see the flames I want to go see the card that I helped uh, create through his stream and definitely come down to the event so this week APG is being added to our team finally we're able to compete in the online cups without having to worry if enable can sub or not so we'll be playing the next two and we have our halo tournament coming up february 21st to 22nd and we're trying to make sure ace gets as healthy as he possibly can so that by the pax event he will be you know tip top shape and be able to play the best of his ability because michigan is close as we do know it's about two three weeks and his illness says that it's going to take him about two to three weeks to get a uh, pretty good so i do know with the life of a gamer as we play in late into the night it's going to kind of maybe hinder him from recovering uh to the best of his ability because he is staying up a little later but we're going to try to make our schedule work best for him so he could get better so our entire team will be ready for that championships like i keep saying so i hope you all enjoy this little update of uh, what's been going on why we have been playing a lot of more playing should start uh today february 2nd i was supposed to travel today but that got canceled due to the snow so prepare for more uh practice coming along and us preparing ourselves for the michigan event and then the final so i hope you all enjoy the video if you did please leave a like comment subscribe and as always this is your boy flanchard i'll see you later peace